new Bordeaux. A modern city with traditional southern values. I underestimated how far he was going to go. What he was willing to do. Visit the historic French ward and enjoy local cuisine at one of our five-star restaurants. Killing them wasn't enough. Lincoln Clay was using them to send a message. Or spend the afternoon in the bayou and take in its natural splendor. Sal Marcano had no idea what he was going to unleash. New Bordeaux. Safe. Family-oriented fun. Make it your next vacation destination. This city survived the War of 1812, the Civil War, and God knows how many hurricanes. But when Lincoln Clay went after the mob, he inflicted more damage than all the wars and hurricanes combined. Lincoln's mother abandoned him in 1947, a couple of years after he was born. His mother, I heard she was Dominican. I always figured his father was white, maybe even not Italian. Not that it mattered. Back then, if you look black, you black. Same as today, I suppose. He stayed at the orphanage until 1958. Now, when did you meet Lincoln Clay? 1966. I was running black ops out of Laos on behalf of the CIA. He was loaned out to me via joint CIA DOD task force. He was a quiet boy. Good boy. Two Purple Hearts, the Bronze Star, and the Distinguished Service Cross. He served his country with honor and distinction. After the city closed the orphanage, he fell in with Sammy Robinson. Sammy ran the black mob over in Delray Hollow. I can't say I approve, but often colored boys didn't have a lot of options back then. Boys like Lincoln, the ones who've been abandoned, they're always looking for a home, always looking for a place to belong. I think he thought he'd find it in the army. Thing is, once that's lost, you can never get it back again. When he returned from the war, Lincoln ended back up over at Sammy's. Now Sammy owed the Italian mob a whole lot of money. And he needed Lincoln's help. It's a damn shame what happened. It breaks my heart. Hey, yo, ребята! Всем привет! С вами Ганс. Игрушка под названием Mafia 3. Но пока здесь закручивается сюжет, нам все объясняют. Поставь свой сочный лайк. Сделай тебя еще сексуальнее. Как я понял, в игре нет русской озвучки, поэтому будете читать эти титры сами. Я не могу одновременно играть с Лизой Still say this is the craziest goddamn thing I ever heard. Using real money to rob the feds. Well, hell, man, not like this is our cash. This all came from Skeletta. Besides, peanuts compared to what we're gonna haul out of there. Is everything we need to burn? Yeah, that's it. I grab the keys to the truck, then we can get the fuck out of here. Так. Lincoln, pick up the keys. Значит, это у нас Линкольн, главный герой. Блин, качок какой. Сейчас рубашка на спиняш порвется. Sure like ну пойдем с ним что-нибудь нужно сделать. Угу. Так, ну его мы, наверное, убивать не будем, раз он нам действительно помог. Напарник он сам пришел. А с этим мужиком-то что можно сделать? Погоди. В тачку забросить? Или его куда-то можно спрятать? Да, нет. Вроде с ним ничего не сделаешь. Хм. 
А, это интересно. Да погоди, может его можно с собой как-то увезти? Может и нет. <laughs> Ладно, лежи здесь. Сейчас потихоньку будем осваиваться с управлением. On, Блин, почему тогда его можно было взять? С тендерка что-то можно сделать. Сейчас, ребят, я смотрюсь. Игра для меня новая, здесь все для меня новое, поэтому... Ладно, погнали. Пускай я там лежу. В помещение, как я понял, бежать нельзя. Можно только идти. А, -а, -а все, до меня доперло. Его можно взять и бросить в реку. Пускай в реке плавает. Дай пройти. Да, 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 там крокодилы. Да? Ну-ка, крокодил. Крокодил. Поешь. Даже, кстати, ачивку дали. Приятного аппетита. Значит, это было дополнительное задание. Избавиться от трупа. А тут что? Тут у нас ничего. Ладно, погнали в фургон. Все. Поехали, ребят. Какая музыка там. Как нам и сказали, это примерно 70-е годы. Always a good idea to dangle someone out there. Use them to get everybody's attention, then you just slip away. So answer me this. What's the craziest thing you saw over there? You don't want to know. Hell, man, I'm a taxpayer. I got the right to know how my money's being spent. Oh, Georgie Marcano pays taxes. Damn right I do. That's how they got Al Capone, and I ain't going to prison for no fucking tax bill. Играть и читать одновременно. Are you going to answer the question or what? We, uh... We on the coast of Quang Nai, evacuating the civvies for Charlie overran everything. Anyway, we getting them onto a medical ship, and this woman walks up. She got a baby in one hand and the leash to a pig in the other. She starts up the ramp, and the MP stops her and tells her, you can only bring one thing on board. So she tosses the baby into the water. MP goes ape, tells someone dive in after the kid, starts screaming at the woman, wants to know what the fuck she's thinking. You know what she says to him? She says, I can always have another baby. Jesus fucking Christ. Hey, man, you asked. Well, I mean, yeah, but I thought you were going to tell me a story about some gook getting his dick blown off or something. I mean, God damn. It's not a fault. But not like you think. The conditions over there, man. Jesus Christ. One day, you're raising cattle, tending your rice. Next day, everything bombed flat. You put people up against the wall, they will do anything to survive. That better been one delicious fucking pig. Блин, жалко, что нет вида из салона. Ну ладно, будем ехать так. Но графончик здесь хороший. Приятный. Мне нравится. Наконец-то не закончили болтать. Можно спокойно теперь доехать. А то мне что же интересно узнать, что они там говорят. Приходится иногда поглядывать и на дорогу, и на субтитры. Так. Оп, красный. Ну да ладно, не страшно, это игра. Да, походу. Так 
Что, давай речи заворачиваем. Ладно, нас решил пропустить. Видит, что дураки за рулем. Ну, поездочка, кстати, была не, не короткая. Спасибо, спасибо. Some of these fellas might get a little uh, rough with the language, and well, I ain't like I never been called nigger before. I know, but I'm just saying, if I go along with it, ain't nothing personal. The only thing I care about is getting our hands on that money. Как я понимаю, мы сейчас будем грабить банк? Или что? When I say something about being hot, that's when we make our move. All right. Так, а здесь что? Вход? Я на карту смотрел. Ладно, пошли здесь. Ну. Открывай. Понятно, здесь домофон. What's this shit heel doing here? Affirmative action. You know how it is. Old country spinning on a goddamn toilet. You can follow me. As for you, go on and grab those bags off the truck. You'll be carrying them to the burning room. How much y'all bring in? Two hundred thirty-eight thousand. Молодец. Значит, если он черный, значит, он должен таскать груз. You need to check that scatter gun. You packing anything? Still in training. Good. One last goddamn thing for me to worry about. You can pick it up on the way out. Давай, давай, проходи. Buying rooms down in the cellar. This way. I ain't seen y'all around these parts before. Y'all's over in Georgia for a while. He just got out the service. And my cousin's been trying to get on here for over a year now. Was in the Navy for two tours. Got medals falling out of his ass. Government tells him thanks, but no thanks. That's a crock of shit if I ever heard one. Sad day when a God-fearing white man can't get a job. That old nigga who staggers in is hiding on the spot. Так. Ну, открывай. Что ты мне пальцем показываешь? You bastards better not be playing with each other back there. Fuck you! Оба. Шериф. Шляпа. You know y'all that much go. That Washington's been shuffling around on account of the war. It's here, and it gets sent to Dallas, and it comes back. It doesn't make a lick of goddamn sense. Hold on. Here we are. И куда мне это нужно положить? Put those bags on the table there. Нифига себе бесшумно. Так. Давай отваряй речь. Сейчас еще того нужно будет устранить. Да, Тощий, дай пройти. You know 
Called over there last night. Told them I want to sell it. Told them they need to be out for weeks. And the man, his name's uh, John. Starts laying in them. Huh? Еще один готов. Так, ну-ка дай-ка твою пушку возьму. Так, перемещение, перекрестие, прицел. Так, поддерживать. Ну, это как всегда. Ага, это поменять плечо. Все. Без проблем. Так, смена оружия. Удерживайте L1, используя. Так, выбор оружия, потом отпустите. Угу. Так, убрать оружие, это зажать вверх. Убрал. Достал. Это переключение. Ну, в принципе, легко. Дай мне научиться, мужик. На неровне не пили. Наш первый банк. Годзилла. Нас она везде преследует. Кто тут? Кто в Анчартаде? Кстати, проходить Анчартаду будет тоже в описании. Ссылочка на плейлист. Опа, и а это как? Давай речи. Сейчас будем осваиваться с стрельбой. Стреляй ты, ё-моё. Как у него ноги хорошо отлесили в сторону. Готов. Опа, промазал. Ты еще жив? Походу жив. Последний. Еще один. Опа, вам двоим повезло. Хотя бы жив остались. Фига в нем силы. Так, помощь в прицеливании. А, так, 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 так. Понял. Нет. Я с помощью пока играть не буду. Она там, кажется, стоит и так легкая. Пускай так она и остается. На легком режиме. Так. А как патроны подбирать? Или они автоматически подбираются? А, не автоматически. Все. Вопросов больше нет. Сейчас еще кто-то нас придет. <laughs> Я говорю, дрещенок слабый. Мы сейчас с одного раза. Так. Так, до тех пор, пока он не окажется в зеленой зоне. Затем нажмите квадрат. Все? Открыли? Так просто. Ну. И пистолет, и пули мы возьмем. Так, жизнь у нас пол полная, если я не ошибаюсь. А где жизнь? Наверное, та зеленая полоса справа над картой. 
face way worse than this over in Nam. Little smoke don't mean shit. Stay close to the vault, watch for the drill. I'll deal with these assholes. No. Who the fuck is coming for us? Found the fucker. Jimmy had men all over the place. Now, one of them worked at a cleaner's and stole the uniforms Georgie Marcano and Lincoln Clay wore on the day of the robbery. Another one was a janitor at the Federal Reserve, and he provided a rough layout. The robbery of the Federal Reserve was timed perfectly, and none of it would have been possible without the involvement of Sammy Robinson, Lincoln Clay, and the rest of the black mob. Это значит, сейчас у нас флешбэк. События, которые происходили до ограбления этого банка. You just come from Vietnam? That's right. I was a Marine in the Pacific. You take it from me. Just because you're home doesn't mean you're back. You understand? People around here, they don't, they don't get it. Never will. <laughs> Keep your ass out of trouble. Уже поздно. Sorry, I'm late. Got caught up crossing the bridge. Don't worry about it. Excuse me, sir. I'm looking for my stepbrother, Lincoln Clay. You seen him? Used to get ticked off if you were even a minute late. Kiss my ass. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> <laughs> How was the trip? Being how this is the first time in four years, and somebody telling me where to go, what to do, or how to do it, it was fucking great. <laughs> mm. What's new with the old man? Man, don't even get me started on pops. He used to pull his head out of his ass. Same as ever then. Brother, you have no fucking idea. Damn, Ellis. She's looking good. <laughs> Just like I left her. <laughs> Man, even I know not to fuck around with your car. Mm. Da, его. Alright, come on. Yeah, I'm ready to go home. Нам опять ехать на машине, как я понял. Так, задать маршрут. Так, так, так. Угу. Угу. Понятно. И куда нам? Вот сюда. Видимо, сюда. Ну, поехали. What if the plane crashes? What if the train's delayed? What if they call him back? And he'll stand in front of the kitchen window and sip his whiskey like he was expecting you to come strolling up the sidewalk. Don't say nothing about me telling you that. I'm going. I won't. He'll be fine once he sees you. Ever since Mama Hell, you know how he gets. Тихо, я тут еду. Ушли в сторону. Не протиснулся. Ладно, страшно. Вот был бы здесь вид от первого лица, было бы удобнее машину управлять. Так, если вы будете совершать преступление, вести себя подозрительно или нарушать правила дорожного движения. Угу. Я не нарушал. I say show. It's free money as far as I'm concerned. Anyhow, a month back, Marty drops me a line and says they're moving into heroin, that they're looking for a partner down around these parts. Can't imagine Sammy was too keen on that. I never told him about the weed. That ain't nothing to nobody. But this, I gotta talk to him about. I ain't said more than three words, and he's yelling about the feds. How we don't need J. Edgar up our asses, and what the fuck am I thinking? Selling dope with kids running around the neighborhood. We ain't selling no dope to no children. <laughs> like they got any money to begin with. <laughs> Fucking around the side. Heron was pretty Most serious shit. Knew a couple guys over in Nam who were running it. Wound up pissing off the wrong person. 
Got their throats cut. Shit, man, I know what's what. That's why I'm talking to Georgie about it. No way Sal's gonna go along with that. Georgie says he can keep his old man from fighting out. We'll still clear the hollow in Frisco, just selling the French wall. George's Uncle Lou won't say shit as long as we give him a taste of the action. I don't know, man. George is a cool cat and all, but heroin ain't the kiddie pool. Come in on it with us. I bet he'd agree to a three-way split. <sighs> I don't know. I kind of need to lay low a bit, figure some things out. Yeah. All right. Так, ну посмотрим, кто это мог быть. Кому нас хочет предложить на работу. Вот неудобно. Блин. Субтитры зачитал с ним проект. Я об этом и говорю. Неудобно одновременно ехать и читать. She got half the guys in the hollow sniffing around, asking her out. Turns them all down. She's only. Пошли уже хорошо болтать. Ну. Почему я не могу поговорить? Бред какой-то. Что Все черные. I'll be better once I get some of that shine in me. I always did love corn whiskey. I would like to make a toast. My father used to say that the real worth of a man came from the mark he left on the world. When Lincoln first told me he was joining the military, I was against it. Too dangerous, I say. Let those people fight their own war, I say. But then I realize, Lincoln needed to go out and make his mark. And that's precisely what he did. I'm so... so proud of you. Paul Lincoln! Bienvenue à la maison! Paul Lincoln! Bienvenue à la maison! Нет, no one else. Вот он. Imagine being trapped in a dark room and there's no way out. And every fear, every nightmare you ever had is in that room with you. And there's no escape from any of it. And then, one day, a door opens, and you're free to go, just like that. The thing is, you made your peace with your terror and your fear of death. And now part of you is afraid to leave it behind. But what choice do you have? Every soldier has to walk through that door. One way or another. Man, <laughs> whiskey's going hoy in the morning. Hell, man, just sleep it off. The room's the same as you left it. 
I'm gonna take the basement. <laughs> the basement? Why the fuck you wanna crash down there? I'll see you in the morning. Man, that wall must have really fucked you up. Конечно, в таких условиях ты жить, тем более сколько он служил. Тем более, если это были горячие точки. Ну, конечно, здоровый. Прям такой Халк. Только не зеленого, а черного цвета. Я видел то, что на э, кровать в другой стороне, я просто зашел сюда смотреться. Что тут вообще да как? Неплохой такой подвальчик. Опаньки. <смех> Знак плейбоя. Да ладно, ты прикинь. <смех> Ух. Так, один журнал есть. Из четырех. Тут как-то их маловато. Ламповый телевизор. <смех> Офигеть. Так, здесь сейф. Открыть его, соответственно, нельзя. Ну да, давайте ложиться. Что ж еще здесь осталось сделать? Ничего. Сейчас поговорим, пообщаемся. Здесь вроде больше ничего нету. Так, оружия тоже нету. Barely have two nickels struck together. Now we paying for all that food. We wouldn't be in this mess if you would have listened to me. What mess? Not something you need to worry about, Linka. I got it under control. Have it your way, old man. Не сомневаюсь. Let him be. He needs to cool off. You mind telling me what's got him so riled up? We've been having uh, problems with the Haitians, but like I say, I got it under control. Well, trucks all loaded up. I figure we got enough out there for. Should I? Should I come back? In honor of your returning to us safe and sound, I made a donation to Father James here. Supplied him with food he can hand out to some of our needier family. Well, I was hoping you'd lend me a hand, Lincoln, and give you a chance to see the neighborhood. This thing with the Haitians, how serious is it? Ah, you know Ellis. Someone looks at him the wrong way, he's on them like a wet dog. Like I said, I can now uh, come back. Nonsense. Lincoln needs to get out. Enjoy the day. Besides, be good for the two of you to spend some time together. Mm. Gone. Those people waiting on their food. Oh, I saw Langan a couple times once he was first back. <laughs> he told me he wanted to leave town, head out to California. Now, he had a friend in the service who could get him a job working at the Mare Island shipyard. And the only reason he came back was to tell Sammy and Ellis goodbye. But then he found out about the trouble Sammy was having with those Haitians. So he decided to stay and help. Those Haitians, they are bad news. No talking Lankin out of it. Whatever else he might have become, Lincoln was always loyal. Правильно делает и думает. Well, the most likely, three-month apprenticeship to start, then the union lets you in. You tell Sammy and Ellis? Not yet. I'm gonna wait a few days. Didn't want to spring it on them since I just got back. Так, ладно, давайте когда на этом заканчивать, пускай они пока общаются. Ссылочка на плейлист и паблик ВКонтакте будет в описании. Подписывайся, не забудь поставить свой сочный лайк.
А также заглядывай на мои стримы, ссылочка на Twitch будет тоже в описании. Спасибо за просмотр, до скорых встреч, пока-пока.